Recently, I noticed that more and more content creators are using and recommending a tool called StanStore. So I decided to try it out myself and share my opinion with you. By the end of this video, you will be able to decide if Stand Store is the right fit for you and if it can replace multiple tools that you may be using right now and save you money. I will also answer a few questions about Stand Store that I had initially and didn't quickly find answers to them. So let's go! First of all, what is Stand Store and why would you need anything like Stand Store? Basically, it's a tool for creators that allows them to sell digital products, coaching calls, courses, webinars, and other things just from the link in the bio that we are all used to on social media. If you're building an audience on social media and want to point them to your freebie, digital products, or your profiles on other platforms, you would usually use Linktree or other similar services. StanStore can do all of that, allowing you to create a nice, customizable page with all the links that you need and take it even further. The other thing that you can use StanStore for is to sell your products. If you sell digital products, course memberships and so on, you need a place for people to check out, to enter their contact information and credit card information and pay for what you're selling. A usual approach here would be to build a simple funnel, for example, I'm using ClickFunnels for that, and then an autoresponder for email follow-ups. In my case, it would be active campaign. But now StanStore can replace this setup and you can create your products and checkout pages directly in StanStore. Moreover, you don't need any tech skills for that because the platform is quite straightforward and easy to use. To sum it up, the reasons why you would use StanStore is if you need a link in a bio system and you need a place to sell your digital products, courses, collect leads and so on. And on top of that, you want a tool that is easy to use and that doesn't cost you an arm and a leg. As mentioned, I noticed that a lot of content creators are using StanStore right now, so I decided to give it a try and let me show you how it works. So after you create your StanStore account, and by the way, you can find the link to a free trial in the description of this video, you can go ahead and set it up. It's quite easy and you will see the setup steps here on the dashboard. First, you can add your profile image. I don't have this step visible here because I already completed it. Then you can add your social links, connect your payment gateways like Stripe or PayPal. And after that, you can go ahead and start creating your first product. And that's exactly what we're going to do. To create your product, go to my store, click add product. And as you can see, you can create and sell a variety of products in Stan Store. First of all, you can create a freebie or elite magnet. Then you can sell digital products like some guides, ebooks, spreadsheets, templates. You can sell coaching calls. And with that, you can also replace Calendly because your customers will be able to schedule a call with you in Stan Store. You can create custom products, small courses, charge for recurring memberships, create webinars, add some external links to your stand store and also promote stand store using your affiliate link. Let's quickly create one product so that you can see how easy it is to use stand store. We will go with a freebie or a lead magnet. If you're not familiar with this concept, it's usually something free, but something valuable, something that will help your audience that you give away and in exchange you collect contact information from your audience. And this way you can later follow up with emails and promote your other products. But before we get to that, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to enable notifications to not miss out on the future content. To create a free product in StanStore and also have the form to collect the email addresses, you will need to click collect emails. On the right side, you will see the preview of how this block will look in your stand store. And here we can customize it. First of all, you can choose an image. You can either upload an image from your device by clicking on the button here or select an image from the gallery. Let's search for something like laptop. Next, you can change the text. You can adjust the headline and subheadline. For example, you can write something like top five mistakes to avoid when you buy a house. And my subtitle is read this guide to save your time and money. And you can see this text appearing on the preview here. Next, you can adjust the text that is visible on the button. 
and select which contact information you want to collect on the page. As mentioned, your free product is meant to collect contact information from your leads, and that's why we will need fields like name and email, and if you want, phone number field. You can also add other fields, but they are not required on an opt-in page. After that, we need to add the digital product that we are giving away. Scroll up and go to the product tab. You can upload the file by clicking on the upload here. And that will be a free file that you are giving away when somebody opts in on your page. After that, click publish. And as simple as that, we have our free product and also the input form created in Stand Store. Let's say you also want to sell some digital product. To do that, click Add Product, select Digital Product, customize the view of this section on your page, go to the checkout page where you will be able to adjust the text and also set the price. We will not adjust anything here, I just want to have this product created to see how it looks in the store. I uploaded the file here and after that I can publish my product. And right now our store page would look like that. You can also easily rearrange the products. You can drag and drop them. And once you edit all the products that you want to show or sell in your stand store, you can just grab this link to the stand store and put it on Instagram, for example, or any other social media that you're using. When somebody clicks that link in your bio, they will see your stand store with all the products that you created. In our case, it would look like this right now. And they will be able to opt in for your free product or buy any product that you're selling. And all of that is possible in stand store. Well, now you understand how you can create your products in stand store, there are still a few things that I want to show you. First, you can edit designs of your store. If you go to edit design, you can choose different themes for your store. And also customize colors and fonts. You cannot fully customize the look of your store, so you can only use the templates that you can see here and change the colors or fonts. But I think when you're just starting, it's more than enough. Next, when somebody buys your product, you will see the income report here. And you can also check the analytics with different metrics like store visits, total revenue and leads. In the customers, you will be able to see the contact information of people who opted in on your pages or made some purchases. And as you can see, it's quite straightforward and super easy to set everything up. And you get all these features just for $29 per month. It's definitely an affordable price, considering how many tools you can replace with it. Stand Store also has a plan that is priced at $99 per month, and of course, it comes with additional features. Now, there are a few things that were not clear to me when I signed up for Stand Store, and I want to go over them now. Maybe you also have similar questions, and this will be helpful to you. So the first thing that I was thinking about was, okay, I can connect my lead magnet here, I can collect email addresses, but what's next? Can I actually send follow-up emails to people who opted in on my form and requested a freebie? If we go back to the product and then go to options, you can see that first of all, Stand Store will send a confirmation email when somebody opts in on your page. And that email will also include the link for them to download your free product that you promised on the opt-in form. You can also customize the body of the confirmation email here. There is also the integration step. We can connect the stand store with MailChimp and then we would send our email follow-ups in MailChimp. In my opinion, MailChimp is not the greatest autoresponder and not the best solution for email marketing. As mentioned, I'm using ActiveCampaign and I believe that's the best tool for email marketing. And if I would want to connect StanStore with ActiveCampaign, I would need to use Zapier because there is no direct integration. It is a possible solution, although I have to mention that the free plan from Zapier has quite some limitations. And if you get a decent amount of leads on your form, then you will have to pay for Zapier quite soon. And I kept the email flows for the end. Because you cannot create email flows on the lower plan from Stand Store, you can only do that on the $99 plan. If I try to add a flow here, 
you will see that it will lead us to the page and offer us to upgrade to the pro plan. So to sum it up, it is possible to send emails from the stand store, but you would need a pro plan for that. And if you're using the $29 plan or the lowest plan, you would need to connect either MailChimp and send your emails from there. Or if you're using a different autoresponder, you would need to connect it through Zapier. But I assume that in the future, Stand Store also may add more direct integrations with other autoresponders. And the next thing I was wondering about is, can I actually create simple funnels in Stand Store? because it seems like the next logical step in the process. Or can I just make simple pages where I can upsell my clients on some other products and offer them something else? In fact, you can build simple funnels, but only on the pro plan. Also, if you consider offering a discount code, a payment plan, order bumps for your products, or an affiliate share, it's only possible on the $99 plan. So after trying out Stand Store, I can confidently say that it's an awesome solution, especially if you're just starting out. It's easy to use, the cost is more than affordable, and is much less than what you would pay for all the tools combined to get all the features that Stand Store offers. However, I also see cases where Stand Store wouldn't be a perfect fit. For example, I have funnels with order bumps, upsells, downsells, and long form sales copy. And for that, I would probably still stick with ClickFunnels. Although I haven't tried email flows in Stand Store, I assume that if you require complicated automations and flows with different conditions, an autoresponder would be a better fit for this task. After all, it all depends on your needs, but again, I believe Stand Store is a great solution, especially for beginners. And if you would like to try it out yourself, you can find a link to a free 14-day trial in the description of this video. That's it for today. Thank you for watching and thank you for making it till the end of the video. Don't forget to subscribe and enable notifications and I will see you in our future videos. Bye-bye.